Alright guys, I am here today to share with you the best burger recipe of all time. Let's just jump right into it. I got some ground burger here. I've got some jalapenos, depending on how spicy you like it. Spicy, sweet, just saucy, juicy, crunchy, delicious. I definitely love spicy food. I'm just going to give them a rough chop just to kind of make them blend into our burger. I don't know about you guys, but I find that um, jalapenos out of the jar are more reliable to be spicy because sometimes I'll buy jalapenos from the store, like the fresh ones, and they're not even spicy. It's so weird. Anyways, I like the ones out of the jar. Just put those straight into our burger. I'm so excited. Obviously, if you don't like blue cheese, you can use another cheese, like mozzarella would be really good with this, or Parmesan, something like that. But I'm gonna use some blue cheese, kind of break it up. We got some blue cheese crumbles. Uh-oh, missed the dish. Might do a little bit more. On Instagram, um, I did like a taste test, and oh my gosh. It was so good, but I also had I had so many people like begging me to post a video showing how I made it. So here we go. All right, got a blue cheese crumbles in there, the jalapenos and the burger. Okay, so next I'm going to do my seasonings. Some garlic powder, shake it right on there. Um, like smoky seasoning is by Kingsford Original Smoke. Got some other stuff in there too but it's just a really good all-around burger seasoning or meat seasoning then just a little bit of pepper because we do have those jalapenos in there a little bit of pepper and then also we're gonna add some Worcestershire 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 put some Worcestershire right on on there yes ma'am and we're not measuring anything we are just winging it this is my favorite way of cooking we're just gonna we're just gonna go right in there mix it around get all of those seasonings peppers and cheese i'm so excited <laughs> okay so next we're ready to patty our burgers not rocket science patty a burger but i do have a little bit of a method that i like to do i kind of like to make them like flatter then I guess some people like them like pretty round um, but I like mine flatter and then I'll do the little dent so I'm gonna finish up patting these and then I'll show you guys what is next because we are definitely not done <laughs> okay done patting these look absolutely stunning just absolutely stunning I love onions. Um, I'm going to grill these onions just to give them a nice little char. I'm going to oil my buns, okay? Because you guessed it, these are going on the grill too. Not being too picky, but I will say, Frankie's growling, but I will say my favorite burger bun are these potato potato buns. I don't know what it is. They're like potato roll buns or something like that. They're so good. I'm going to put these on our grill pan as well. They'll go on towards the end around the same time as the onions just to give them a nice little crisp and warm them up, toast them up. The most important part here, the sauce. I did not write down what I did last time, <laughs> but the majority of the sauce was mayonnaise. Um, so I'd say about two tablespoons of mayo, some ketchup, wait, I'll show you the color that you want it to be, some Dijon, Dijon mustard, maybe about a tablespoon, trust the process. We got some sweet baby rays. We got some sweet baby rays. Barbecue sauce. Hickory and brown sugar, baby. This is no joke. 
All right, still not brown enough. All right, that should be good. That's looking really good. Oh yeah, that's the sauce. I also have some shoestring french fries in the oven because those are going on the burger too. Elo's excited. Got just a few more minutes on these birds. To toast them on each side and kind of push them down a little bit. So we're just gonna keep an eye on those. All right guys, it is like 90 degrees outside. It was so hot by that grill. Um, but the burgers are ready to be assembled, y'all. I am so excited. Got my nice little toasty bun here. I'm gonna put that down. Then I'm gonna pick my baguette. This one's looking delish. Next, I'm going to put on my onion. I like that. Next, I'm gonna put some of this secret sauce. Just really, really slather it on there. Oh my gosh, my mouth is watering. This looks so good. Really, really slather it on there. We want to put some extra jalapeno, jalapeno slices right on top. You guys see this right now? I love it spicy. Obviously, if you don't like spicy, you could use like pickles or something like that. Tomato, but ooh, baby, look at that. We're going to put these crispy shoestring french fries right on top you guys right on top and this sauce actually this bun got a little toasty but there it is the best burger of all time thank you dear lord jesus look at this burger I gotta have another bite. Mm. The best burger of all time. Oh my gosh. I will see you guys next time. Look at this burger. Let me know if you guys try this burger. You really should.